Hey guys, it's Michael. Welcome back to Michael in the Morning. Today is Monday, December 7th, 2020, and this is your second stimulus check and second stimulus package update, as well as news report. We have a lot of big news to go over from three different senators. The first one we're gonna go over is Democratic Senator Mark Warner, who came out and said that we are gonna have a stimulus bill proposed by the end of the day today, a new bill that will have a lot of bipartisan support, and it should be able to pass by the end of this week. After that, we're gonna go over another interview from Senator Bill Cassidy, who came out and spoke on the $1,200 stimulus checks and if this will be included in the next stimulus bill. And finally, at the end of the video, we're gonna go over what Senator Joe Manchin said about the second stimulus bill as well. So let's just get right in to the updates. Senator Bill Cassidy came out yesterday and spoke with Fox Business News about the status and the specific timeline of the second stimulus package. U.S. Senator Bill Cassidy said yesterday on Sunday that he wouldn't rule out a second round of stimulus checks next year, but they're not as high of a priority as other elements will be to pass this year. He explained how there still may be a new round of $1,200 checks, but they won't be in the bipartisan $908 billion bill that is now being drafted in Congress. Cassidy said how this package that they are currently working on will include another round of forgivable loans for small businesses, more money for state and local governments, aid for transportation systems, an extension of the eviction moratorium, and increased unemployment insurance payments, these $300 per week payments for those people who are unemployed. However, he went on to say that this $908 billion bill is not a stimulus bill, it's a relief bill and it's something for the next three or four months to help those who are in the greatest of need. And then after those three or four months, once Joe Biden is inaugurated and takes office, how they are going to look at including stimulus checks and passing another bill after that. But he says, as of right now, this is just to hold over everyone in the meantime. Next up is Democratic Senator Mark Warren of Virginia said yesterday on Sunday that a proposal for another stimulus package could come as early as later today. Warner, who is part of a bipartisan group of senators, is currently hashing out a compromise on a stimulus bill. He told CNN's Jake Taper that they are currently working on an agreement and they are very close to getting the agreement passed and getting a bill proposed. He explained how he thinks that they will have the top line numbers done and how they are working on the right language so that they can have a piece of legislation as early as later today. Warner said it will be the fourth emergency relief package with a $908 billion price tag that has been proposed in the last two weeks. He said how this proposal will give targeted relief for unemployed Americans, for people in food insecurity, rental assistance, small businesses that have run out of their Paycheck Protection Program fund, and additional funds to those minority businesses that have been extraordinarily hit hard. He explained how they put additional assistance in this bill finally for broadband, which is an academic necessity, and additional dollars around the vaccine distribution and assistance for hospitals. And the bottom line is, Warner said that despite the fact that neither Republicans nor Democrats are getting everything they would like right now, he said that he has pretty high assurance there will be enough votes to support the passage of this bill. And finally, Senator Joe Manchin, who is part of a bipartisan group of lawmakers that last week introduced a $908 billion stimulus bill, came out on Sunday on NBC's Meet the Press and said that a deal must come together and that lawmakers don't have a choice but to pass new legislation quickly. He explained how this is an emergency relief package that will give support to Americans through April 1st and the first quarter of 2021. He explained how the $908 billion bill that they're looking to pass is an investment they're making into the citizens of this country and trying to keep the economy from collapsing. But he said it could be even more important, this $908 billion bill, than a $2 trillion bill that would be passed in February or March if they didn't do anything right now. He said, Bottom line is, and most important thing, is that something needs to get passed now, and how if they waited until Joe Biden was inaugurated, it might be too late for so many people and small businesses. So ultimately, all three of these senators are very optimistic that a bill will get passed very soon. They all say that the economy needs a bill to be passed, and that they are currently working on drafting a new bill that should be announced later today. So anyways, that's what's going on with the second stimulus check and second stimulus package as of Monday, December 7th, 2020. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to get four free stocks valued up to $1,600 when you download the WeWool investing app using the link down below. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.